what we think we become. I'm Lakshmi Gantan and this is the channel where I share with you guys the new words I learn. In today's video, we are going to see only one word and we are going to see how this particular word is used as a noun. And as I told you in the previous videos, a word can, like not all the words, but a few words can come in different uh, parts of speech with different spellings. That is, like a word can come as a noun and as an adjective and as an adverb and as a, also as a verb. So likewise, a word can come in these four categories. But in today's video, I'm going to share with you one word and how it is used in one part of speech. That is, supposing if the particular word that I'm going to say is a noun, today we are going to see only how this particular word can be used as a noun with its meaning and uh, the different example sentences. So the word for the day is strong. It is a noun, which means a slow, relaxed walk, especially for pleasure. So that is what it means, strong, as a noun. This very word can also be used as a verb. So that we will see in the future videos. But in today's video, we are going to see only how this particular word is used as a noun. So, strong means, as I told you, like it is a, a slow, relaxed walk, especially for pleasure. I have a few example sentences for this word. They are, after dinner, we went for a stroll along the beach. The second example is, sometimes before, we, uh, before writing a story, he takes a stroll. The third example is, we took a stroll in the garden. And the fourth is, a short stroll before dinner helps him eat properly. The final example sentence is, I asked the couple to go for a stroll in the park on a return from shopping. So these are the example sentences that we have seen with this particular word and its part of speech and its meaning. So now I'll, tra like, I'll translate you guys all these words and uh, sentences in Tamil. That is stall. Abrina inna. Or varin mahil chikada met medu vaha nada the selda. Idu me stall ina lekha padi gade. Yena pura padi gade. The example sentences translation is: After dinner, we went for a stroll along the beach. Uh, translation: Yera vu puna vu punda pin naangal kada loram nada do. Second example, sometimes before writing a story, he would take a stroll. Sila sami yengalil, kadhi yedudu vadar kumun, avar nadakpaar. Third example, we took a stroll in the garden. Nangal totatil nadandavun. A short stroll before dinner helps him eat properly. Iram unam 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 siridhu neram anadu siridhu thunam nadakpadu, avar sariyaga unam udav uyeradu. The final example is, I asked the couple to go for a stroll in the park on a return from shopping. So these are the example sentences with this particular word being used as a noun and only when it means a slow relaxed walk especially for pleasure. So this is the word that we have seen for the day. I will see you guys with another word in another video. Thank you.